No, I don't. All right, Queen. Got our first clue, I think. Yay. I don't think it's the first clue yet. <laughs> Your experience is ready. Our experience is ready. First clue. Okay. Okay, we solved our first clue. We know it's the red dessert dive. So that's where we will be going first. This is so exciting. <laughs> Okay. But then when we go, this will not, not be, be here. Yes. Right. So we're supposed to make it right here at Taylor. We are on our way to our first location, which is Red Dessert Dive. Red Dessert Dive. I think the twins are right behind us, but not sure. We should be the first ones to arrive. We met Eileen and Cardi. They were ahead of us, but then we passed them at the hint work spot. So now we're headed to our first, we got our first clue, um, red dessert dive. Says we're three minutes away. Okay, we'll see. Okay, so we are half a mile away from our location. Look in the sense it should be somewhere on the left. Is that it? This is it. Is it? Yep. Oh, look at it. Oh, there's the parking right there. Oh, no. We're going to have to make a U-turn or something. No, the twins. The twins just got there. I'm going to make a U-turn. Okay. Uh, oh, there okay, is the parking right there. Okay. I don't think so. Are they not open yet? Oh, yes, they're open. Okay. All right, we've made it to our first spot. So excited. Oh, I'm so excited. This is so excited. We had our first uh, stop and it was a cute little bakery. I can see Let's Get Baked like that. But anyway, I'm excited to see what the next stop is. Aren't you? I am. All, All right, right, let's do it. Okay, right, so we're about to continue on to our next thing. Okay. Okay, let's Your up. clue to unlock stop two. Can we you and spell? I think this is going to...
Okay, you ready to hit it? Let's hit it. Yes! The last train for me! <laughs> We're good. Okay. Amazing race. <laughs> no, we <good>. 7-Eleven <laughs> Heights Boulevard. Okay. Oh, I'll read it. Welcome to Milan's Crapery. This is an authentic French crapery. We highly recommend you try out more of the crepes. How could you not? There are so many to choose from. Sweet to savory. We recommend giving the Nutella one a try. Mm. Mm. Add to your basket two crepes filled with love. Oh, and Brie and Jam. Ooh. Please let them know your name when you receive. Okay. Ooh, you know, I like some Brie and Jam. Oh, I like some Brie and Jam. Oh. <laughs> Public House or Onion Creek Cafe. Oh, okay. All right, 7 Eleven. All right, it should be coming up to the right. So what is it called up. again? Melange Crapery. No, it's not mine. The Cloud Creamery. Will be I think I see it. Oh, look at it. There it is. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Oh, there's local food. Is that a farmer's market? Oh, my goodness. That's a farmer's market. There it is. Just take a bite, okay? Just, just take, take a little bite. I like it. Okay. A brie and strawberry grape. Mmm. I like it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You wanna taste a bite? All right, we're going to continue on our next. Let's get cracking. Use the image chart below to decode the name of your next destination. Do this by using the first letter of each designated image to spell it out. All right. All right, Postino or Postico? Postino. Let's reveal, Postino. Yes, Postino, Postino Heights. <laughs> Postino. It's a simple idea to create a place that will connect with one another with great food. Ooh, we're going there for a salad. Okay, mixed green salad to mm -hmm. share, okay. <laughs> so as we're thinking, we're thinking, oh, this might be in walking distance. So when we look it in, if you look right there, we haven't left yet. Oh my gosh. Postino. It's right there. I looked at that so many times. Me too. Joseph. Looked at it too. <laughs> All right, so it's right across the street. I don't need the 14th, the 14th To show how much you mean to me The one thing The one thing You ready? Alright Alright Postino Heights Definitely we'll come back there A little chill spot Ready for our next clue Your clue to unlock stop four Picnics are great Picnics Picnics with heaps of different deli items are amazing. Protein. <laughs> the following text has been encrypted. To find your next destination, you must decode the text. The key below will help you solve the clue. Oh, okay, okay. Oh.
Okay. What? So underneath it, I mean, underneath it would be the next. Yeah. Okay, so you got it? I think what? so. Okay. So, by Agrico Hospitality, Chefs Ryan Pear and Morgan Weber. This is one of three popular restaurants they have in the area. The others include La La La. They strongly believe you should know all about the food you're eating and exactly where it comes from. Many of their menu items are made in-house, and if not, they make sure they're made from high-quality producers. Add to your basket, what better way to say, I love you than a charcuterie board. Mm -hmm. Coffee there. It's great to play our amazing co-games. All right. Joseph, I think they're doing it too. These people right here. Okay, so I think we have found another family that's doing it. Another I think competitor. another competitor. And it's these people right here. Hold on. Right here in this car, right there. So we are trying to beat them to the next destination. Joseph, do you think you could do it? Mm -hmm. They have not started their vehicle yet. And I'm not very sure if they are actually competing. So we may be competing against a ghost that doesn't um, exist, but we'll see. And we don't know if they just went to the next thing and didn't. We we took time to you know really go over this clue. Yeah, because the left side. What 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 I saw was they came out of the crapery, and I think they got extra things. Oh, there it is, right there. <laughs> Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We got to go all the way up to the next light. But no. anyway, so then I saw. Oh, here it is, right here. I saw them walking back from Postino's with a bag, and when they opened, yes, this is sort of soccerish vibes. But they opened um, their trunk, and I saw a what could be a cooler and what could be. Um, what do you call a picnic blanket? So we'll see. We'll see if we see them. If we see them, do we say something? Yes. We say something, right? Yes. We say something. Um, we, we definitely help say something. But to notice that you came from Postino. This is not stalkerish, but I noticed you from the crepery. Then we were trying to get our next clue. What clue, man? Wow. Come on. Oh, dang, this boy just skipped these people. Hey. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, so they just pulled up, and I know this is them. I know they are doing the race, and I think Hi. we're. Hi. Good. We couldn't help, but we feel like you're following us. <laughs> yes. It's a race now. It is. Right? It's a race. My wife. Was... <laughs> yes, my wife. Was... She's like Joseph. I think they're doing it too. <laughs> Have fun, guys. <laughs> What'd she say, Joseph? She said, oh, it's a race now. It's a race, and so we cannot play. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, there are two other people. There are two people. They had some walkers. That's what the lady was talking about. There are some walkers. She said that. What do you mean, did we pass what? The turn? Oh, shoot, so we could've walked from there? <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna catch up because that place is really quick. Okay, so oh my gosh, y'all, this is hey, you crazy. Just what? I got my recorder, but uh, I need my wife to help. I know, but you designated me as the recorder, so I feel like I have to record. But this is so crazy, y'all. This is for real. We cannot get behind because these people are gonna catch up with us, and especially the walkers because. They don't have to. Um, the they don't have to get in the car and do all of that. But at least, and they may be doing their clue right now. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting! Did we see some other people. This is so exciting. Okay, y'all. So we made it. We made it here. 
Um, and I think we can fix it. We're gonna talk. Okay, I thought we were gonna take it together. Okay, okay. Go for it. Okay, so do we want to put the thing in here or no? Oh, put the thing in here. Open up the thing. Okay, it's me. It's me. Um, so we took our picture in front of the mirror. We're gonna put our other little treat in the car. Um, it's over there. You see that? Get it in there. Get it in there, and I'm gonna go ahead and get in the van because. We don't want the people to catch up. I know, I know. It's like, okay, y'all, come on, get a grip, but whatever. <laughs> Why is this so big? <laughs> okay. Oh, there are the ones. All right, continue on. Six out of seven. The five love languages. Did you know there are five love languages? Express, receive, and achieve, blah, blah, blah. Not everyone communicates love in the same way. Different people have different ways to show and receive affection. To make sure love doesn't get lost in translation, let's take a look. At one of the five love languages. I'm ready when you're ready. Encourage appreciation, words of affirmation, verbal compliments that express love and appreciation. Oh, words of affirmation, verbal compliments that express love and appreciation. I want you to know that I really like your, um, your haircut and your face. You do look very nice. And I think I do like the glasses. It's a new you. I love you so much. It's love and appreciate you. I appreciate your excitement for adventure and for you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Man. Okay, physical touch. Use of body, language, and touch to express love. This is mm. and I like touch them. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. okay, next. Symbols that show ooh, gifts. Ooh, I like a gift. Mm, maybe Monday you'll have it. Ooh, I like a gift. What does that say? Surprise. Oh, there they are. There they are, y'all. Uninterrupted. Oh, you can't see that, but you see a picture. Good meal, blah, blah. Okay. Looking at each other's difference. You want to learn? Let's look on the 20 years of marriage on Gary Chapman machine. Continue on. Uh oh, someone's hungry? getting. <laughs> We're hungry. What? No, I'm not. I'm not hungry. I don't know why I said that. The, number six. Okay, when you're ready to eat, proceed to the next page. You're heading. Is that the picnic? You're heading to Stew Park. We recommend heading there via Heights Boulevard. Once you're at Stew Park, pick a table. It's time to feast. Now, feast so on what? Yes. We should have brought our extra. Oh, thank goodness I brought the short tray. Yes. Okay, we might need to go to a different place and get us a tray. We should have got one at, at... We got that tray. That little... No, I'm talking about some food. Well, we're not really hungry. We can get that later. We're going to do Greek later. It's okay. It's okay. But I feel like I might be a little bit hungry now that we're talking about it. I don't know. But okay. Let me make sure Let's go we to the miss the Apparently, that's it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, but... Um, We've had a really good time. It's just been an hour and a half, y'all. So, I mean, I don't know. Maybe fast. Um, yeah. Day. Yeah. We had, it's been great. Yeah. Um, we're at this park. I wish you could turn this, but anyhow, um, we're at the park. We're about to set up our picnic. Maybe we'll go on a little walk or something. I don't think so, but okay. All right. All right. We're here. We're here. This is our this is our spot. This is it. We did it. Yay! Yeah. So this. This is it. This is the park. 
we are at. There's a little trail here if we want to do a little walking. You know, just a little something. All right. We're at our destination now. Mm -hmm. It's got a salad. It's got a charcuterie board. And behind us, we got a live action boxing match. Sanction boxing match. <laughs> and it's a good match. They are really going at it over there. It's us. Um, nice race winners. Think like we technically won. We but Benita was nice enough to give him a little H2O. Oh, you got to put my own. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Alrighty. Goodbye. Bye. Perfect, but you're perfect to me. Uh -huh. Been asleep, you're a dream. I need you. Though we got a past, I want you. And even when it's bad, I love you.